Have you ever wondered what would happen if you stuff a can of great stuff foam inside a watermelon, then blow it up? Yeah, me neither. But with a couple of boys with access to power tools and fire, it's bound to happen. So after filling a hole in the watermelon and somehow stuffing most of the can into the watermelon, we were ready to go down to the woods. After a quick lesson in how not to light a torch, we waited. And after six minutes, this happened. Yeah, not exciting. So what actually happened there was, if you look at the contour, the profile on the top of a can of Great Stuff Foam, like any aerosol can, there's a bunch of ridges and, and stamped parts in the lid. And with six minutes of heat on the bottom of this can, it just heated up and just popped up just enough to throw the watermelon off balance and fall off. After giving the can a few minutes to cool down, we reset the watermelon, relit the torch, and waited another 10 minutes for the result we wanted. Pretty cool, huh? If you enjoy stuff like this, you like DIY projects and blowing stuff up, you might be interested in the course that I recently published on how to build your own Nerf rocket cannon where you can launch Nerf darts and paper rockets pretty much out of sight. Check out the link in the description. We'll see you next time.